Reverend Nancy Mace confronts Secret Service Director Kimberly Cheadle, accusing her of dishonesty and failing to provide the requested information during a heated committee hearing. That is a no. Have you provided all audio and video recordings in your possession to this committee, as we asked on July 15th, yes or no? I would have to get back to you. That is a no. You're full of shit today. You're just being completely dishonest. Mr. Mr. Chairman, completely Mr. Dishonest. Chairman, Mr. Chairman, I want to... Mr. Ch I'm Come on, we have to maintain decorum in this committee, any, no matter how upset we get. Have you provided any and all memos to this committee that we've asked you on July 15th? Have you provided all memorandums within the Secret Service? I would have to get back to you on that. That is a no. You are being dishonest or lying. I, I just, you're being dishonest here with this committee. These are important questions that the American people want answers to. And you're just, you're just dodging and, and talking around it in generalities. And we had to subpoena you to be here and you won't even answer the questions. We have asked you repeatedly to answer our questions. This isn't hard. These are not hard questions. Um, Holding public officials accountable is essential. Nancy Mace's pointed accusations reflect a desire for transparency and responsibility in leadership. She demands clear and honest answers, championing conservative values of integrity in government. Mace's complaint suggests that Cheadle's responses fall short, raising the crucial question of maintaining public trust in government agencies. Mace warns that evasive or incomplete answers from officials like Cheadle could erode faith in the Secret Service and other institutions emphasizing the vital need for honesty and openness.